Dash Clicks grants users the ability to set up their own custom domain to completely white label their dashboard. As an important note, in order to have access to the custom domain feature, you must subscribe to the pro plan or higher. Users will be able to then set this up either as a root domain or a subdomain. To set up your custom domain, you'll want to access your settings, which you can do by clicking your profile picture, then going to settings. Then on the left, go to business settings and click branding. The first section is titled custom domain. Go all the way to the right and click edit. You will now need to decide if you're entering your root domain or creating a subdomain. If you're entering your root domain, it must contain the www. Then click save. Alternatively, you can enter a subdomain. You may use an alternative prefix for your subdomain as necessary. When you're satisfied, click Save. Note that it will take a short period for your domain to update after completing this entire process. After your dashboard officially updates to the new domain, it will appear here as the sole URL in bolded text. However, after this, you still need to complete one more step. Next, log into your cPanel or DNS hosting to edit your domain DNS records. You'll need to add a CNAME pointing to s.dashboardmode.com. You can find this URL by looking at the article below this video. You can find a list of the supported registrars listed in the article below this video as well. Though the process is fairly similar for each, you will find a distinct step-by-step -step process for yours. After you follow the steps in your chosen article, you should be set to go. At this point, the process completes without any further assistance from you. Once the changes have had an opportunity to propagate within your registrar, the system will add your domain to a queue and generate an SSL when it's your domain's turn. This process can take up to 48 hours. If it has not been at least that long, the system is still likely working through the queue. If it has been longer than 48 hours and the process does not show as completed, please feel free to open a support ticket.